what we're going to do now is driver's side rear rocker. There was a patch put in that we're going to pull out and rework. Using the sander here to identify where the spot welds are. Once identified, I'm going to use the belt sander to quickly remove just the first layer and break the spot weld free. Once I cut through all the spot welds, I simply removed the panel. On this side of the car, we were lucky that we could get a replacement patch panel. So I'm prepping to install that now. Patch panel fit okay, but it's going to need a little bit of tweaking to make it perfect. After I marked and cut for the top area here, I went ahead and did a butt weld. With the style line in the door running into the quarter panel here, I couldn't really move anything, but the bottom edge sat about a sixteenth of an inch high. So I used a small Dremel here and a cutoff wheel and cut a slot in it, which I'll then hammer back down and weld closed. Once fully welded, I went ahead and started blending the weld bead. This is a prototype of a weld blending tool that we're looking at coming out with. This thing just grinds the top of the weld bead, so you're not hitting any of the surrounding metal at this point. And no, we don't recommend just using a cutoff wheel on edge. That's not what this wheel is. Blended all the weld areas and then went ahead and uh, hit the weld seams with some Duraglass, just for added durability.